Well, hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. So today I'm going to be telling you about the 30 South sunglasses that I received. I've tested all three of them and the hat. Really like them, and I'll give you some cool details. So let's get right to it. So first off, like I said, 30 South did send me uh, three pairs of sunglasses and this awesome hat to review. Uh, I didn't pay for any of it, but they don't get to see this video before you guys. They don't have any influence on what I say. It's not sponsored. I'm just going to tell you the truth. So yeah, 30 South is a company that's in South Africa. So the name 30 South comes from, like I said, they're from South Africa. And if South Africa had a center line, uh, it would be basically the 30 degree line. And that's where they get the name. Yeah, so there you go. All right, so first up, let's talk about this hat. This is what's known as the Otter. It's a running hat. Uh, it's named after one of the world's most famous trail runs. Uh, but basically it's just a slick back hat it's uh you know you can see here it has some cool designs underneath the bill there uh, which this is actually a really cool feature i like this um, like yesterday i wore it on my run and it was quite warm uh, but it was a little bit of breezy and when down like this and the sunglasses on i still got a little bit of uh of wind into my you know underneath the sunglasses and to cool me down a bit but when i wanted to i could do this if the wind was blowing at me and this kind of funneled some of that wind down more onto my face and it felt really good. So that was a cool feature. Uh, the hat dries pretty well. It is um, somewhat see-through. Uh, it could be maybe a little bit thinner for running in really hot climates, uh, but it does hold water. So if you want to soak it, put it on your head, it feels really good. That's kind of nice. So uh, all in all, it's a great hat. I've been running in this quite a lot and I really enjoy it. It is a 100% polyester. Uh, it's machine washable. You can throw it in there, wash it. You know, I hang mine to dry rather than dry it. Uh, but yeah, there you go. It's a, it's a good hat. It's pretty lightweight too. Let's go ahead and see how much it weighs. So it weighs 62 grams. So yeah, it's about the uh, it's about the weight of a uh, Coros Apex Pro. <laughs> also, I want to point out on the hat on the back here, this is an adjustable clasp. It does undo like this, but then this part is adjustable, so you can really get it to fit just about any head size, any head shape, uh, and it works really well. Okay, now moving on to the sunglasses. This is the Flex. Uh, this is just a super flexible pair of sunglasses, hence the name, Flex. Uh, I really like these for just wearing around, you know, driving, hanging out with friends, hiking. Uh, they've been really good. For running, uh, I prefer one of these other ones a little bit more just because I like some more of that uh, curved lens to give me a little bit more protection on the side from the sun. Uh, especially on trail uh, or just even on the road because with these you get a little bit more light in the side. So uh, they're really great sunglasses for daily use for me personally. I just don't really care for them for running. Uh, but they do not bounce. They stay on your head. Super lightweight. Let's throw them on the scale here. So these are only 23 grams. So that is like super lightweight. So the 30 South website actually says these are the most flexible pair of sunglasses in the world. And they say that they can bend in half without breaking. Look at that. <laughs> It's ridiculous and they're super flexible very they're very similar in shape and size to uh, the gooder sunglasses but these are a lot more comfortable they're a lot lighter they're more flexible and they fit on the head better so yeah if you like the gooders you're gonna really really like these so it is a ultra durable rubber like i said super flexible uh, they do have a high definition optic lens which is what they say is actually designed uh, by NASA. It has like an REVO coating to ensure high contrast viewing and enhanced clarity. Uh, they're also ballistic grade shatterproof. So if you want to go to the firing range, put a couple rounds down range, you can wear these and not worry about your eyes. As you can see too, they are also polarized. They filter out 100% of the harmful UV rays and they're also anti-glare. So yeah. So here's what the flex look like on my head with the hat on. You know, as you can see, they're very comfortable. So that's the Flex. Um, I am going to have a link down below in the description so you can go to the 30 South website, check out all these sunglasses. Uh, it may be an affiliate link if I can get that sorted out, <laughs> or it may not. Uh, so it might help support the channel or it might not. Either way, it doesn't matter. Uh, you can go check them out. They are, like I said, a South African company. So they do ship internationally uh, and the shipping is pretty quick actually. It was not bad at all. All right, let's move on from the Flex to the Pacer. This is a polarized lens as you can see. Again, uh, this has that more curved lens that I kind of like for running. These have been great for running. When I go out running, these have been the ones I've chosen. Uh, the other ones I really prefer for biking. Uh, but what's really cool about these, if you can see uh, up here in the top, they've got uh, four vents, two on each side in the lens. So it kind of lets some of that air get in. And uh, I know when I run in the hot weather, I sweat, it starts dripping down. My, my eyes get a little bit wet around there. Uh, and this kind of helps dry that some. So that's a really cool 
really cool feature, something they put in there that's, you know, I've not seen before. So these ADVX frames are uh, Swiss engineered, manufactured from a uh, like a TR90 material. They're super lightweight, throwing them on the scale right now, and they come in at 25 grams, so just uh, two grams more than the Flex. Uh, but these have a nice rubber nose piece here, which really just sits on the face well. Uh, and they're a little bit tighter than the, the Flex as well, so they're gonna stay on your head while running. Uh, here's what they look like on my head with these with the hat on. So the Pacers also have the HDO, the high definition optics lenses with that same NASA engineered REVO coating uh, to give you that polarized view, give you that really nice enhanced clarity uh, and protect and shield your eyes. These are also ballistic grade shatterproof uh, and also they filter out 100% of the sun's harmful UV rays, just like the Flex did. Uh, so you really can't go wrong when you're running with these, you're gonna protect your eyes enhance your field of vision, just, you know, all around a great pair of sunglasses. Moving on to the Trail RX. Uh, these are probably, probably my favorite pair so far that I've, that I've worn um, from this 30 South brand. Uh, I've worn these uh, on all the cycling rides I've gone on. Uh, as you can see, they are a bigger lens. It, it offers more protection from the sun, uh, and, which is great riding. They fit under the helmet just fine. They've been super comfortable uh, again the just really lightweight. So the Trail RX is what they call the pinnacle of eyewear performance. It actually comes with three pairs of lenses uh, in this hard case that it comes with. Uh, so this one here is the non-polarized mirrored lens. Uh, and then in this little cloth case, we have the uh, gray Cat 3 polarized lens that's interchangeable. Uh, and then there is also a clear UV 400 lens. So again, this is gonna protect your eyes even though it's not uh, a sunglass per se, it's more of eyewear, eye protection, but with that UV uh, 400 rating, it's going to keep your eyes safe from the harmful rays. So you can also get the Trail RX with a, uh, an optional photochromatic lens that'll change, you know, throughout the day, depending on the condition. So if you want to pick those up, you can do that on the website. You can add those and you have four lenses and change them out whenever you want. These come with the same ADVX uh, frames, like, like I said, super lightweight. With the, with the uh, non-polarized mirrored lens, they weigh 24 grams. So uh, one more than the Flex and one less than the uh, Pacer, one less than the Pacer, which is interesting because this is a larger frame. Uh, on the inside of the glass here, uh, we have uh, a very nice nose piece and then a, a rubberized trim piece as well. Sits on the face really well, super comfortable. And the side, uh, the side frame here is also very comfortable. On the face here, it just fits and stays put. It, they're, they're fantastic. I really, really like these ones. And then just like the other two pairs of sunglasses, these are also uh, ballistic grade shatterproof, 100% UV, uh, UV resistant for those harmful rays. Uh, they do come with the Cat 3 polarized protection lens as well. Uh, so they're just all around a great pair of glasses. Really, really nice for cycling. And I've worn these running as well. They've been great. Just they really filter out the sun. Just, I mean, it's, it's a big lens, obviously. Okay, so there we have it. That is the 30 South uh, collection of sunglasses that they sent me. We've got the Flex, the Trail RX, and the Pacer sunglasses, uh, as well as this Otter hat, uh, which has been really cool. I've enjoyed all three of them. They each have their own certain uses. They have more sunglasses on the website to choose from, some different, uh, different types, different shapes, uh, other gear as well. Check it out down below in the description to go check out their products. Uh, but I've been really happy. Um, you know, there's lots of different sunglasses out there. These are moderately priced, uh, comfortable, lightweight, uh, and they get the job done. So what else can you ask for from a pair of sunglasses? I mean, I can't think of anything else. So anyway, thank you for watching. I appreciate you all. If you've tried the 30 South sunglasses, any of these pair, any of the other gear on their website, uh, anything, uh, you know, any of their products, let me know below. I'm curious to see if you've had good experience with them, if you've had any issues, any, you know, lens issues or anything like that, let me know. I'm curious to see what you guys think. If you want to take a look over here on this side of your screen will be a video that YouTube says is best for you. You can take a look at that. And then over here will be a playlist of some gear reviews, other things that I've reviewed, other products, uh, clothing, massage guns, watches, all sorts of stuff. So check out one of those. Thank you for watching. I'll see you on the next one.